So this question is a translate word problem question. And all that means is I am going to just read this one sentence at a time. I am going to resist reading the entire question from beginning to end. And I'm going to make sure to translate, which basically just means write down any quantitative information along with its relevant details. So the first sentence here says bacteria are growing in a liquid growth medium. Nothing quantitative to write there. It's just kind of understanding what's happening. So, uh, sentence two, there were 300,000 cells per milliliter during an initial observation. So I'm going to say initial, which I don't just mean start time or at the beginning of this experiment. So initial is 300,000 per ml, milliliter, okay? Next sentence, the number of cells per milliliter doubles every three hours, right? So double every three hours, right? So we're starting with 300,000, and we know that that number doubles every three hours. Next sentence, how many cells per milliliter will there be 15 hours after the initial observation? Right, so we're basically saying, well, what happens at 15 hours? All right, so there's my translation here, these three bullet points. Basically, is this question translated? So I am going to just make a chart, right? Kind of not exactly draw a chart, but I'm going to just make a progression here of what should I expect to happen. So I'm starting off with 300,000. After three hours, I'll put arrow and three hours, I expect this to be 600,000. Why? Because the question tells me it doubles. After another three hours, it should be 1,200,000. Why? Again, because it doubles again. After another three hours, right, and we're up to, again, three, six, we're up to nine hours now, that should be 2.4 million. And after another three hours, we should be at 4.8 million. And again, that's three, six, nine, 12. So just one more double. So another three hours gets me to my total of 15 hours. And that should be 9,600,000. Now, of course, there's a much faster way to do this than to draw it out the way I did. But I wanted to make sure that it was visual. I wanted you to see visually basically what's happening in my mind and what's happening with the math that I would have been doing. Um, so you know, of course, you don't have to draw it out this way. You recognize that if it's doubling every three hours, you have five doubles in 15 hours, right? Because three hours times five is 15. So you could probably get to this answer a bit faster than what I did. But again, I just wanted to show you the visualization of how I get from start to finish. So our answer here is choice D.